This is Stalin. Van Hitler. And How you can call us horrible people. Yeah. Now we're going to be doing Dave Tries Return to Castle Wolfenstein. Gabe has already played this game to its completion before. And, uh... So he gets to watch Dave die horribly. I am death incarnate. Uh, bring him on. Um, yeah, I actually started playing this a little while ago and literally played none of it. Like, I, I will say this. Any game that help, has me killing Nazis, I approve of. I, I'm not saying anything negative about this. In fact, if you are oh. a game maker and your game involves killing Nazis, we will play it. I didn't skip that. It just... Skipped itself. Yeah. Wasn't that good then, apparently. Yeah, even the movie scene knew it sucked. Ooh, screaming. No. <laughs> The microphone's really far away again, Dave. You gotta stop doing that. There we go. More screaming. Uh, uh, a little more intense than that. Uh, oh no, I've been hurt. Here we, here we have a skeleton. <laughs> <laughs> You're in prison. It's a prison shank. What do you expect? Oh, oh and I have a Luger now all of a sudden. Four bullets, though, so stick with the shank. Oh, there's... Ooh! And Turn to Keppel Wolfenstein. <laughs> Keppel Wolfenstein. Do it. Do it, Dave. <laughs> Shank them doors. Teach them who's boss. <coughs> Show them what it's like to be in a open, real Nazi so, game. So, uh... Yeah, let's, let's keep going. One of these days, there's gonna be <laughs> Nazi rights activists... <laughs> Or like, you can't be killing Nazis, that's just bad. Stop making games about it. Those people will not last very oh, long. Oh, F? Um, that gotcha. corpse is on fire. Watch it. Stab him, dude. You have a knife. Jeez. It's just a Nazi. corpse is on fire. <laughs> uh. <laughs> die, Nazi, die. Die, Nazi scum. <laughs> What the hell? Let's... Stabby, stabby! <coughs> Whoever made... <coughs> crap! Whoever made crap? Whoever made the stabbing animation in this game needs to get some... award for terrible stabbing animations. Because <coughs> <coughs> that's just awful. It's funny in a bad way. Oh, okay, we got some. Okay. Oh, there yeah, we go. It's funny in a bad way. You don't complain about that. You just accept it. <laughs> what? Well, he thinks you're bad in a funny way. What? I, I, I'm, I'm confused. Um, I'm always confused. Wait, so can I? It's a cancer puzzle. Not anymore. It's not. No, it's destroyed. You, you keep missing the Oh board. god, words. Hell no, I don't know. Uh, screw you words. Go back, go back to what? the clipboard. You missed it when you stabbed at the clipboard. Stab it again. Make sure you hit the clipboard this time. Oh, it won't break. Yeah. yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, you. They said F you. <laughs> they are Nazis. <laughs> See, you. folks, these are actual Nazis. <laughs> All the Republicans you keep calling Nazis, they don't dress like this. They in actually public. dress using good clothes. In public, they don't dress like this. Well, in private we do, <laughs> but still. I mean, we're not going to deny the fact that Dave is the shrine to Hitler in the basement. What? <laughs> no, I, no, I don't. No, I, it's it's no. a shrine to killing Hitler. No, no. It, what the hell are you talking about? It's a shrine to the Morrowind map. That's my shrine, Dave. That's not yours. Then, I don't know what the hell you're talking about. There is no shrine in the basement to anything. Uh-huh, sure. Dave's trying to hide the truth. Ooh, look! Can I stab this with a knife? And yes. will it break? No. Damn, the immersion is ruined for me. <laughs> hey, people are like, oh my gosh, I can't break something with a simple gunshot. Then you shoot a car. Cars don't explode when you shoot them, folks. Hey, buddy. Unless you shoot them with an M1 Abram, in which case everything explodes. <coughs> when did this game come out? <clears throat> a long time ago, Dave. Before you were even a sentient being. So, wow, that's a long time ago. No, um, well, you only just recently gained sentience, so it's not that, bad. It's not that long ago. When was that? Now, when did I gain sentience? That train ride home. No, it was before that. I had sentience before that. Uh, sure. 
keep telling yourself that, Dave. That's locked. You have a knife, though. Can't you just knife your I have a door? feeling I can't break that door with a knife. I'm... You act like it's made of steel, Dave. It's really immersion breaking when you can't break doors of steel. <laughs> and I can't destroy a steel door with a knife. It just ruins the game for me. Who thought of this? It's poor game design. Oh my god, there's so many people who complain like that. Seriously, <laughs> like that about video games, and they just need to be shot. In oh, okay, so this just goes back. Okay. And I can't go back to this. And, Screw and, you, game! And if you thought for any second that I'm going to give Dave any advice or help in this, you are dead wrong. He has yet to die, which is actually kind of impressive. Which is a good thing. I don't really want to die at all. I'm going to jinx it now, but... Well, you only have 82 health points left. That's almost 100. Yeah, but still. Help. It's not enough to take on uh, Cyborg Hitler. Ah, I turned that annoying beeping off. Ooh. Is that like, can I hit B? Yeah, ooh, yeah, okay. Go stab him, Dave. Get him. Take him boss. You should save once in a while. <laughs> That's a good idea. Let's do that. I, with some of these older games, I forget that they, uh... They don't auto-save when you walk through the door? Yeah. I, I hate how people like that, like, oh my gosh, Marwin's so hard because it doesn't auto-save and you walk through the door. It tells you, and the loading screen, I guess PC Master Race doesn't have loading screens, but on the Xbox, it tells you on the loading screen, save often, Vardenfell's a dangerous place. They didn't have the auto-save functionality back then, folks. It simply wasn't possible. Alright, pick up the med pack. Oh, Hitler. Oh, you can break Hitler, nice. I want to break Hitler. Take him downstairs, torture him for a few hours. But he never comes to our live streams anymore. Like, what the hell, Hitler? He never shows up. Yeah, and we actually had Joseph Stalin on standby. And yet then, we get Joseph Stalin on standby, and, and then Hitler, Hitler never show shows up. up. He's scared of him, Dave. Also, Coward. this is kind of, you know, speaks volumes about our channel. When we have two of the world's worst psychotic dictator murderers on our channel. And that we want them back. Ow, 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 ow. Don't worry, you got 37 HP, you're fine. Go in there, guns blazing. See, I don't have, like, I, I have a problem with killing off certain races because it's just not right. Ethically, it's wrong. I don't have a problem with killing off Nazis, though. Like, if you want to get all the Nazis and neo Nazis in a concentration camp and gas them, I wouldn't have an issue with that. As long as they're given a fair trial first. Fair? Who said I was going to be fair about it? That's right, it's you. I'm a horrible individual, Dave. No, oh, look, you have a swastika on your arm. Yeah, and? To the camp with you. But Great. it was really the Buddha symbol. Liar. You're saying that to get out of trouble. <coughs> But yeah, I guess if you want to be nice, we can give him a fair trial, but it better be a you know, speedy trial. None of this crap that death row takes like a thousand years to get to. Yeah, I hate that crap. Most people die of old age before they get there, Dave. Especially if they are like the 67 other murderers. Oh, here we... I told you there's some necromancy in this game. You didn't believe me. You found a treasure item. Dun, dun, dun. There's going to be some necromancy up in here. Just wait. There's also mutant dog things. Yeah, I know. There's a lot of crazy stuff. It goes down, yeah, I know, man. It kind of perfectly captures Germany <laughs> in the way they live their lives. Nothing is normal here. And now that wasn't a shot at Germans, that was a shot at Germany. Mission stats. Yay! Oh, I di didn't die. Yes. I am surprised in my self. Dave, there's still 20 minutes left in this. And so far, though, I have not died. You will. Thank you for the comments. <laughs> Uh, I've seen you play Wolfenstein 3D Brutal Version. You died a lot, Dave. That game's really hard, though. <laughs> oh, but it was so funny. That's because the major discovered the job on the free side again. Let's see. More Nazis to kill. This should be a game that is literally Nazi Genocide Simulator. Where you just like go into this world with nothing but Nazis and you kill them all. There's no mission objective, there's no storyline, you're just there to kill Nazis. Oh, I did that button, though. 
Oh, probably open this. Time. No. What people really don't get, I, I kind of get bothered. Like I know the whole Holocaust thing. Was, a lot of Jews were killed. But what people don't realize is Hitler was worse than just killing Jews. He actually killed blacks and gays as well, with a lot of vehement hatred. Now I don't know about you guys, but I actually have black friends and gay friends, and possibly a gay black friend. I don't know if he's gay. No, 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 not he's dying, not like dying. Gay. But, uh, throw the grenade, Dave. But, yeah, I, I would not like to see them be, uh, holocausted. So, I'm glad that Hitler's dead, for the most part. Uh, he's actually on the moon. He's, he's on, on the moon with Sarah Palin. No, Sarah Palin's in Russia, Dave. We've been over this. He's on the moon with Bigfoot. And the Loch Ness Monster. In their special moon base where the Nazis have gathered for one last strike on Earth. Sarah Palin is writing polar bears with Vladimir Putin while her husband watches because he's not much of a man. I really don't know anything about Sarah Palin Hansen, so I can't really say any much about her. Him. <laughs> her, him. She just looked at her. Jorge. Name. Jorge. Jorge. His name's Jorge now. Hey, Jorge was a good guy. I don't even know who Jorge is. Oh! Nazi. No, no. Oh, you're dead. Okay. Uh, I think Jorge is the Spanish name for George. Could be wrong. Someone correct me in the comments, but I'm pretty sure that's how they pronounce George is Jorge. I would love to know what the hell that button opened up. A lot of people would like to know what that button opened up, Dave. You're never going to figure it out, though. It's you. Probably not. Yeah, you're right. I have negative five confidence in you. <laughs> negative five confidence. That's a good number. Oh, hey, you really put a rail safety rail there. This is Nazi Germany, Dave. They were exterminating people based on their freaking religion and nationality. Safety rails were not at the top of their list. Should have been. By the way, what would be the Nazi equivalent of FEMA? The Nazi equivalent of FEMA? Yeah. Or uh, uh, OSHA. OSHA. Oh. I don't know. God, that would be painful. It has to be something where you, you know, they enforce you wearing gloves when handling Jews. <laughs> that sounds about right. Because <laughs> that's all they really cared about. Hitler, Hitler really had it out for the Jews. And I'm not entirely sure why. Like, there's this whole thing about his art teacher being Jewish, and he failed him twice, or rejected him twice, something like that. Because, you know, Hitler was also gay. He got rejected by his Jewish uh, art well, teacher. Well, he rejected his, like, artwork. Yeah, I, I know. But uh, Hitler was apparently a good artist. And who knows what it could have been had that Jewish man not done that to him. We could have had a very much more artistic and colorful Holocaust. Much more artistic and colorful Hitler. He could have been fabulous. <laughs> Imagine how horrible it would be if someone finds a secret diary of Hitler and Hitler was gay. How <laughs> bad would that go down? <laughs> if I were gay, I would be very angry at that point. Milo would probably turn straight, just to avoid it. Didn't Milo <laughs> say that he's gay by choice? Something like that, I think. Because he likes black guys or something like that. Mm -hmm. Which, by the way, um, I hope he has uh, some good health insurance, because... <laughs> you know what? I'm just going to stop. Just, just, just know that once you go black, you don't go back, Dave. Also, because you can never walk again. What's the... the uh, not Quarian. Quarian's Mass Effect. The, uh, the giant horned creatures you can play as in Dragon Age Inquisition. I have no idea, but yeah, once you go with them, you're not going to be able to do it. Pretty much die. Which I find kind of weird, because Dorian can hook up with that blah, giant creature. Uh-huh. And Dragon Age Inquisition, like, Dorian, are you sure you want to do this? Oh, oh, hello, Hitler. Are which, you the Nazis? Which, which, by the way... I have played a lot of video games that include, you know, different things like gay people in them. And they all seem to be pretty crappy. Dorian is awesome. The only not good gay guy in that game. It's like, they did a great job of making him as a... Is he an elf? Kind of? No, no, I think uh, Dorian's a huge... Oh, God. Okay, well, as a gay man, they did a good job of making him as a gay man. It's just... It, he's so well done. Oh! oh Now it blows up. Like, oh, now there's, there's the first, the first thing. death. 
Fine, we have 15 minutes. Oh, God. Almost. I'm assuming it's going to start at the very beginning. I should have saved. You should have saved. <coughs> but yeah, Dorian is one of the few people that have made the game that were gay that actually is interesting and fun to uh, have in the game. Game makers need to realize this. Like, when you're making a, you know, what, I don't know. Would you really call gays minorities? Anymore? Yeah, I would call I them minorities, okay. yeah. You're making a minority in a game. Have some fun with it. Don't be all, like, sensitive about it and be afraid to hurt someone's feelings or upset someone. Just enjoy it. Go all out. Because if you don't, there's going to be more. Wait, what? You can kick, yes. Wait, I can kick, but I can't kick down doors. Dave, you're a white American. Americans don't kick down doors. They shoulder doors down. Actually, I'd say Americans most likely just... Oh, wait, 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 there's a button. <laughs> they just blow the doors up. Yeah. Was... They call it an airstrike on the doors. I still don't know what that does, but... <laughs> it does stuff. We should turn off the loud beeping! Beep! 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 Hey, shoot. Someone's backing up! Oh, it was funny. There's a, uh... Health network now in America, now that Trump's in office, that is essentially doing what people are calling fat shaming by saying people need to get skinny because being fat's unhealthy. And these SJWs on uh, Tumblr, Tumblr yeah, exactly, the cancer site, are going crazy about it, or at least they were, I don't know if they still are. Oh my god, this is wrong, look what Trump's done to America! You mean he wants to make people healthy? Just, just God remember, forbid! Just, just remember, during that woman's march after he got elected, he single-handedly got more women to exercise than uh, Michelle Obama in her eight years. Mm -hmm. Well, Japan got more people to exercise than Michelle Obama in her eight years by freaking releasing Pokemon Go! <laughs> there are ways to make people fit. Limiting what they can eat in schools and making them do different exercises you think are good and you approve of are not the ways to do it. You should say it. I had to eat the hot meal, yes. I mean, people are just... just yeah. But yeah, the Wolfenstein 3D. Return to Castle of Wolfenstein. Or Capel Wolfenstein. Capel Wolfenstein. Capel Wolfenstein. Look at the Capel Wolfenstein. Sir, but I don't know. I was going to say earlier, I actually want to go back and play Dragon Age Inquisition. It had its issues, but it was still a pretty good game. Yeah. Although, I have to say, it pissed me off that you had to buy the DLC. Basically finish the game. Uh, that is annoying. Um, I never actually bought the last DLC, so I wouldn't mind buying... I think you have to buy it on EA Origins. What I would find on PC. fun is uh, you doing a Let's Play, because it's kind of in the same... <laughs> I might get some flack for this, but it's kind of in the same vicinity as uh, you know KOTOR and Jade Empire. It's made by the same people, so yeah. Well, it's different in many ways, but it, it's in the same vicinity as gameplay as that. So it would be fun to watch you play it. I really need to do a quote tour Let's Play because no one, and I mean no one that I can find on YouTube, has done a light-sided run-through of code tour because apparently being part of the dark side is just easy and casuals like that. Oh, hello. So I need to do a light-sided playthrough of code tour and I also need to do, I, I've been watching a lot of Marvel Let's Plays lately. I don't know if you looked at it. Oh, uh, yeah, I have. It's... <laughs> I had tons of them. Uh, hey, it's gotten us more people on our channel, like Manabil. He's awesome. Go check him out, folks. Uh, <laughs> he did that shot up. But um, a lot of people don't do anything religious in the game. Like, no one's joined the Tribunal Temple or role-played as a religious person. Like, oh, I don't want religion. Ew. Oh, God. Uh, no. um, it's like, people, just have some fun with the game. Role-play. You're missing out on a really good quest line. Not a quest line, a guild, basically. And it's really good loot. Some nice artifacts to the temple quests. I know, I want to join the Imperial Cult in my game. Or, I'm thinking about it. You can join both, and that's actually lore friendly, surprisingly. Because, you know, Bethesda. Well, the, what's, the, what are the different religious groups you can join in Morrowind? There are three total. Alright, there's the Imperial Cult, which is the Nine Divines, basically. But you can't join the Bolivian for some god awful reason. I mean, of all the games, that should have been the one that had it. Uh. <laughs> This is the Tribunal Temple, and then you end up joining the Ashlanders for, you know, the whole thing with the Zer and all that. That's not technically a religious organization, but you're joining the Nervarine Cult somewhere in the main quest. Because, you know, cults are awesome. 
But, uh, what the heck? Did you just get thrown up in the air? That was really bizarre. <laughs> it was bizarre. But yeah, you can join all three of them. And joining the Tribunal Temple and the Imperial Cult can net you some really good loot. Oh, I should do that when I get back into playing more. And I've been playing way too much Rim, Rim World. I've been just having a lot of fun playing that. Oh! Um. But when I do a blind, not blind, when I do a, a deep RP playthrough of Morrowind and open W for a channel, it's going to have religious overtones like crazy. Because no one else is doing that. Um. Ooh, what do we got here? Grenades. Which some religion mode. Guns. Yeah, I was actually I was thinking of doing a uh, Dragon Age uh, Origins Let's Play uh, at some point. I've actually never played through <coughs> all of Dragon Age Origins. Are you, are you gonna try to get Dorian to hook up with a giant guy? No, that's that's Dragon Age Inquisition. Oh, you said Origins. Oh. Uh, not Dorian would be in all of them. No, he's not. Darn. He's actually got some witty insults too. That's another thing game makers need to do. Better insults in games. Really, the Morrowind Nexus has nothing for religion mods for Morrowind? That's sad. Hold on. Okay, I think we're good. Anyway, so yeah, so far this is very fun. Uh, I've had, kind of played a plethora of shooters lately, so... Dave likes shooters, apparently. Uh, mm, just for, like, Dave tries and stuff. You should do a Dave tries, like, some kind of strategy game you've never played before. There's not too many. <laughs> I, I'm sure there's at least one you haven't played. That Probably I Japanese own? One. Well, not that you own. Yeah, uh... Yeah, see, I don't have a ton of money. <laughs> So yeah, I know there probably will be some strategy one game. You are eventually going to start working that job, so you'll, you'll be able to start saving up again. You'll finally have 50 cents of your bank account. Oh, I've got more than 50 cents of my bank account. 75, right? whatever. Uh, more than that. Um, and hopefully our YouTube continues to take off. It's like kind of off the you know off the runway now. It's gaining altitude. And eventually it will crash and burn into the side of a mountain. Absolutely. Um, <laughs> That's our goal, anyway. <laughs> We're gonna where the hell did there. these people come from? Well, Dave. When, when a man loves a woman. Yeah, see, I think it would be funny to say when a female <coughs> Nazi and a male not. No. No, this is true. They both have to be Nazis, otherwise they wouldn't breed with each other. Because they're freaking psychopaths who want to murder everybody who's not blonde hair, blue eyed. Yeah. By the way, Dave, fun fact, you would not survive Holocaust. You don't have blonde hair or blue eyes. Yeah, I've got brown eyes and brown hair. Although I'm German, which is kind of weird. Mm. Your eyes are greenish brown. Yeah, they kind of are greenish brown. You still wouldn't survive the Holocaust. This is true. I wish they would go full green. You just want full green. Well, Dave, if you're not a uh, ginger, you can't have green eyes all the way. You only do that if you have no soul. I, I still want not. Brown eyes are just so normal. See, my eyes are multicolored. They're blue and green. They have actions not mixed together. They're actually separate. Just weird. I am... Uh, let's save. That's... Also, my face is hideously ugly. I can confirm this. This is why every time I look in a mirror, my reflection commits suicide. Oh, that was right before the mirror shatters. Awesome, 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 awesome. Mm. So I haven't been giving these games a rating. Do you really have to? No, I don't. I just say it's good or not. I, I'd give this game a rating of ten out of ten. You should play this game. We we do say if we think people should play them. You should play this one because you get to kill Nazis. That alone makes the game worthwhile. Ooh, is that a beer mug? Yes, it is. Plus twenty stamina. But there's also a lot of fun guns, great missions, necromancy is involved somewhere down the line. How long is this game? Fairly long, all things considered. Like, shooters in general seem to be pretty short in my opinion. You can finish them within the day real easily. 
No, not all of them. Not all and say all of them, I said in general. But, you know, this one seems to have quite a bit of content in it, and seems to be like a lot of fun. Also, you have 10 health left. You should probably get that looked at. Oh, I, oh, I, you oh. have 4 health left. <laughs> I didn't realize I only had 10 health. <sighs> or 4 health. I know there's a meal over here, so. In the middle of a gunfire battle, I'm just gonna Toast. run away, eat food, come back. It's kinda like Skyrim, in the middle of a fight, you pause the game and start eating a bunch of food from inventory. Have you seen that uh, one guy who does the Day in the Life of Morrowind or something, or like a minute long? He's done two of them. Yeah, I've seen those. It's uh, Morrowind in a minute. That yeah, guy's yeah. hilarious. He is one of the better YouTubers out there. Like, you weren't subscribed to him, by the way, on the channel. We weren't? Nope, I, I thought we were. No, I subbed to, to him for you. Thank you. I, I sometimes read the hit the sub button. <laughs> but if you guys haven't seen him, he does an amazing job of doing that. Kind of Don't thing. we have more subs than him at this point? Or something? Hopefully not. <coughs> that guy deserves more, but he doesn't have more subs. It's so funny watching him traveling more when he hops down the street. And Cliff Racers come out of nowhere and kill him. Okay, what the hell? What? Just wait for it, Dave. Just wait. It's coming. It's a long ways away. No, I can see it. It's not moving. Well, then that sounds like a personal problem. Maybe you should go turn the power back on or something. Yes, yeah, stand on the gear. You thought this level would be that easy? No, I just... Didn't. <laughs> he hopscotch down the stairs. I'm dead. So I'm gonna hopscotch down the stairs. <coughs> I'm dead. So I'm gonna hopscotch down the stairs. I'll take that helmet and your grenades and hit this button. Your grenades. Wait, that was an alarm button. No, I don't undo that. And health. Awesome. So far, only, like, what, two deaths? One, two. Skip a few. 99, 100. Something like that. I bet there's a bunch of enemies up here now because they came over on the gondola. See, now, in the other Wolfenstein, you died a crap ton. Well, because it was much more difficult than this. This one, you, you, you're killing Nazis and enjoying it. Uh, Nazi I have the Wolfenstein. You fascist. How dare you kill Nazis? That's just um, evil. Wolfenstein, the new order game. I haven't played yet. The newest Wolfenstein. El Pusho is about to know. There you go. There we go. I'm on a gondola. You're gonna have to duck. I'm on a ru I'm rush. I'm on a Nazi gondola. It's not a gondola, Dave. It's a thing. <sighs> you know what a gondola is, right? Small boat, water. Is that what? What am I thinking of then? Can't remember the name of it, but it's not gondolas. Are you gonna stop here? Get out, grab some loot. This game is uh, multiplayer because I played this with my brother going through it. It was fun. You mean co op? Yep. Well, I'm pretty sure there's also a versus mode. Ah, I remember playing, uh, very fondly playing multiplayer Star Fox Assault on my GameCube with like four friends. But you don't have any South Korean friends. I don't need those. Um, wow, Dave, that's messed up. Uh, I believe they're all Hispanic friends. Um, that's cultural appropriation. That's what we're playing with Star Fox, Dave. And Star, let's. I remember Star Fox Assault was the one we played the most. Then also, um, one of the Medal of Honor ones. I think it was Finest Hour. I've been trying to find it. They don't sell Finest Hour on PC. I think it's only on. Uh, GameCube and PS2 or something like that. And I was upset about that because that game was a lot of fun. I remember the campaign very vividly. Hunt me some Nazis. Da -da 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 -da. Nazis. Kill the Nazis. Da -da 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 -da. Let's kill this last Nazi and then. Uh, one that's hiding over here. Uh, apparently, I okay. Go this way. 
Nein, 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 nein. Oh, nein, you dead end! You should get that, uh, thing of Hitler doing that at the very end of the last place at the get boom. Oh, nine, you did. I prefer the, uh, the Hitler, what is it, glow stick one? What? You haven't seen that one? No. I'll find it to you. I'll find it and show it to you. Okay. End it. Let's end it here. Uh, let's break these radios. Perfect. Nice, you know. Yeah, I know. Anyway, I have 260 ammo for this. It's never going to get all used. Uh, anyway, so yeah. Very fun game. Um, you definitely should play it because killing Nazis. Especially if, play, if you played any other Wolfenstein games, you'll probably enjoy this quite a bit. Um, I believe next will either be Slav Slavination, if I decide to buy it or not, or The Quest, which is kind of like a Daggerfall ripoff, or I should say, directly inspired game, because it's really hard to not rip off Daggerfall, really. Anyway, um, so yeah, thank you for watching. Anything you want to add, Gabe? Not really. It's a fun game. I really enjoyed it. You should play it with a friend and a grenade launcher. Ooh, breakable class. Nice. Anyway, uh, thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next Dave Tries. Bye.